Yes, lads, Jubilee in here, and Team of the Week 3 is here, and it's had a bit of a redesign. Um, so it's still the same amount of players and all of that, but um, you see here the start, and you can see all the players in it. So, striker son, yes. A centre mid Mkhitaryan, right mid David Silva, Team of the Week captain Benacia, uh, Rodriguez, and a Grand Fitz. And the rest are all gold ears, and then there's some silvers down at the bottom. So this week, um, you do the drills, then you do the challenge, same setup that way. Um, exactly the same in terms of that aspect. However, you're rewarded for completing so if you get all the silver reserves, you get another 100 team of the week points. You get all the gold reserves, you get a 10k coins and a gold starter. You get five gold stars, you get 250k and 300, thief, 300 team of the week points. And if you get one elite starter, you get a player of the month point. So you need a player of the month point from each week. The pre first two weeks, you need to get the captain to get that point. And if you get all, obtain the previous award, if you get every starter player, you get five million coins. What the hell? five million coins well i haven't got a single elite team of the week so from the previous two weeks but if you can get lucky you can get yourself five million coins on top of all those players and then obviously towards the player of the month um here is the player of the month tab and um, there's been the two already which you had to get the captain this time you just need to obtain all reserves all gold starters and an elite starter and next week will be the same and then you get your four points and all of that business and jazz so they're all still untradeable but it seems a little bit better and it rewards you even if you only get a few done because obviously you can get the silver you'll probably end up getting most of the silvers doing it this way and there is the chance of the elite team of the weeks from that section now which is cool and obviously that's they got at least one gold and also there is that more reward for grinding i guess um, but um, let's see, so there's the, the five, the ten there, but they are in the store already anyway, the bundles. So we're going to go open a bundle or two and see if we can, see what we can do. Um, but it does seem there is some progression through, even if you only manage to get, say, the reserves and all of that. Which is cool, I guess, for different levels of play style. If you're free to play, it seems a little bit more worthwhile. If you get extremely lucky, you can get lucky. Yeah, that's what I just said. Let's jump into this bundle and see what we can do. See if we can finally get an Elite Team of the Week player. We haven't managed to get one yet. Um, let's see if week three can be our lucky week. Um, so you get points on the packs now. Um, what else do we get? I'm sure there wasn't 10. Oh no, it's saying pack one of 10. So you get points. Um, and okay, so. Okay, did we get the points instead of the player? I guess so. Did it say that? Did I miss that? Um, we'll see how the rest of the packs go. Okay, cool. Having a bit of loaded time. That's no good. Uh, so points. Are we going to get this? Maybe they've changed that. I guess they've probably changed that to be um, that make to get it twice in a row. I guess they changed it, which is cool because it means obviously you open a few and you can earn yourself a gold or better. And what we're we going to get in here? Still nothing. We're not even getting the starter players. Obviously, the starter players are pivoted by the fact that they have a dynamic picture, even while still gold. So, that's cool, I guess. Uh, where's that picture gone? No. Right, back to what we're doing. Team of the Week. I wonder if you can get more than 30 points, or if it's always 30 points. Uh, let's have a look. Nothing to shout about there. Yeah, I bet I, didn't really, I bet I just assumed it was the same as the previous weeks. Um, and that's what you get every time. Okay, 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 cool. I swear we're just getting the same players on repeat just again and again. We haven't even got any of the start players yet. Never mind an elite player. Oh, why is this loading? Um, let's have a look. Pittman, Granger, there are. His inform card last year was sick. Oh, and there was a start player, Sacco. It's only a 76 striker, but it's still the start. So we finally got one of the start players. 10 to go. And whatever we're missing from the rest of it, I don't know just sucks so hard that they're still not tradable they need to be tradable and i'm not going to stop mentioning it to them until they finally make them tradable it's just it's just so just make team of the week tradable so everyone can enjoy them a lot grows up and shot especially with drop rates this appalling 
not a, so that we're up to what 25k 25k few points now and not a single uh Boric, he's is he a start yeah he's a start because he's got the picture so that's two starters but send me the gold ones pack number 10 before we get into the top of which is four gold or betters Pittman, Granger, Olsen, Shaw and Cal Calio, however you say his name, I'm not sure. Apologies, Italians. I think he's Italian at least. Let's have a look. Olsen, Calio, Grizzly and Shaw. So still no elites, no elites still. Um, have they changed it? This pack contains 13 loot points and 5 team loot players from this week, including 3 gold. So they have changed it slightly. So that you get one less silver player and you get 30 points. So that makes sense. I guess we kind of guessed that after this first few. Oh, wait, a lot of Johansson starters, they just didn't have dynamic pictures for them. Let's just go check back what the, uh, the screen looks like before we open the second bundle. But still, no elites. This is absolutely terrible, terrible. I know we got the team hero Kane last night, and that was absolutely sick, and it was happy to finally get there. So we managed to get amongst them <clears throat> um, all but one of the golds and we got a few of the starters. So that lets us claim 100 Team of the Week points. So that's cool. Um, that will get us a chance at another gold or better. We need to get one more gold to get a gold starter and then we need five gold starters to get 300 points of 250k and then obviously one elite starter. Um, so cool, we actually only need one. Oh yeah, you need all the gold stars. So we need one more, we need that right back. And then we need, um, who that is, I can't see the name properly because it's a little bit greyed out. And obviously we've got 414 points. So we've got plenty of time for them, but I'm not gonna do them on this video. I'm gonna, I'll probably record them, but um, just because it takes a while to play all the games, I will come back and do them. And heck, if there is some expression there, you'll be seeing it. If not, just assume we've got nothing. Why did I go back to Team of the Week? I need to go to the store. Right, second bundle time. Let's see if this one can provide us any better luck. Moving into the 30k view points spent on Team of the Week territory. And still no Elite Team of the Week. Let's see if getting to 30k view points can be the magic number to get some Team of the Week. Who we probably won't even need or use. But hey, I really want to review that song. Let's have a look. Cool. Pittman, Johansson, Grozav, and I swear it's just the same players every single time. Every single time, it's these same five players. Uh, apart from a couple here and there, it's just the same. So, yep, yeah, same. I swear it's the same three goals in 90% of these packs. It's just the fact that they're not tradable means that if you don't get them, you can't do you can't do anything. There's no way to get them without opening these. Packs and they're, oh, they're just they're frustrating. They're just frustrating because I'm spending fever points in getting this crap. So I can only think, oh, and there we go. We get the final starter right back, and we get Lalich, and we get Sacco. So I guess I'm supposed to be happy with that pack, am I? No, I'm not. Oh, just make them tradable. That's all you need to do. You just need to make them tradable. Anderson, Sadik, Olsen, Grozav, and yeah. Just make them tradable, or do a 10k bundle where you get one elite team, that one elite team of the week player or something. But 5k and you get four gold or better, and they're always gold. It's terrible odds, and that's from spending FIFA points, spending quite a lot of FIFA points on doing team of the week. So you can only then say, well, if we're spending, if I'm spending team of the week points and getting nowhere, what about people who aren't spending FIFA points? It's just, it's just perfect. Just make them tradable. Uh, we get that right back again and still nothing. Uh, I think we've got everything apart from the elites now at least. Um, which means nothing. We need an elite and we've got two well, two packs to try and find one. Uh, sure and yeah of course none in there. Let's see in this one and then we've got the topper. Very much don't see one coming. Uh, no, no. no of course there wasn't. Of course there wasn't. Why would there be? Are they even po are they even possible to get? Can you even get elite team of the week players? There are Olsen, Grozav and Saku. No, you can't. Pathetic, 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 pathetic. But hey, at least we can get the rest of the done and see what that all comes out. Of. But yeah, no, just it continues to be frustratingly rubbish. 30k view points spent on team of the week now and nothing. Let's see what we're gonna get in here. Because that was forgetting all those gold reserves. 
and we're gonna get a cold start we don't even need one uh, oh you get 10,000 coins and then lot who we already have um, come on unlock them so I'm sure I've got all of them yeah I have so this will get me 250k which is nice and 300 team of the week players uh, 250 points which is two and a half goes right let's have a look 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 it just puts them like that cool and we don't have an elite star so that cups us there we need to get one of the elite starters but we have got 10 goes on the week free challenge from doing that um so like i said i'll do these off camera and see how they go but it's pathetic team of the week's pathetic while they're tradable i just I, I i think i assume they're doing it because they don't want special cards on the market interfering while the market settles and stuff but team of the week's always out from the start of any game on fifa and it doesn't have an impact i really don't think it'll have that much of an impact team that we play because most of the players aren't actually that special and they're not even that high rated at the moment like what's your highest this week an 86 Benashia centre back um I don't even think it'll have that much impact on the market especially with the bot controlling the market anyway that can dictate prices to a certain extent just make them tradable leave a like subscribe and I'll see you all later peace <laughs>